Today is Wednesday, March 23rd. I'm Jazz, and it's time for the Lion Lowdown. Please join me in saying our school pledge. Today, I will be the best I can be. I will believe in myself. I will be kind and responsible. I will help my family, my school, and my community. I'm proud to be a military child and an Edward A. White Lion. Hear me roar. Let's see what's cooking for lunch. Today's lunch will be beefy cheese nachos with salsa, seasoned corn, dinner roll, diced pears, and milk. Breakfast for tomorrow will be whole grain Pop-Tarts, fruit punch, orange, and milk. Happy birthday! <laughs> Celebrating their birthday today, Paisley and Harper, happy birthday to you! Now to the forecast center for all our weather update. Now for today's weather forecast. There will be thunderstorms this morning, then partly cloudy this afternoon. The high for today will be near 75 degrees. It is currently 56 degrees. Let's go to Mr. Taylor for a special report. Hey, Komochi's kids. It's Mr. Taylor back with you for another Komochi's lesson. During our last lesson, we talked about the feeling sad. For this lesson, I want us to give a drum roll on our desks or laps for our Komochi's friend that will help us to learn about our next Komochi or in English, our next feeling. Now, everybody give me a drum roll. And here he is. Here's Bug. Bug is here with us to discuss the feeling brave. And here's how you spell the word brave. And here's what brave may look like. Does anyone remember why Bug sometimes tucks his wings behind his back just like this? It's because he sometimes feels shy, scared, cautious, afraid of change, and he does not like to make mistakes. But Bug is here with us today to talk about how we cannot be brave without having hard to have feelings like shy, nervous, or afraid. We want to put our brave feeling in front of those hard to have feelings like shy, just like this. And Bug has to practice being brave when he feels shy, scared, or afraid of making mistakes. Now Bug has a great friend in Hero, and here is Hero. And Hero is a great friend to Bug because he has helped him practice being brave. Hero has reminded Bug that being brave is not a superhero feeling. It's when you get yourself to do something that's new or hard. Hero does this often when he goes on his big adventures. Hero has helped Bug recognize times when he has been brave. Bug will show us how he can be proud of himself for being brave. I was brave when I went down a big slide. I was brave when I helped a friend who was sad. I was brave when I told my teacher the truth about something that happened out at recess. I was brave when I got a shot at the doctor's office. Wow, nice job, Bug. It helps others be brave when we share times that we are brave. And when we notice somebody is brave, we want to encourage them. Here's an example. I jumped off the diving board and into the deep end today. That's great. I'm happy for you, Bug. Bug and Hero have learned that it's important to be brave when we are beginners. This means that when we are trying something new. We need to be brave to try something new because we might make mistakes. And we can tell ourselves something like, I can do it, or I can do hard things. Now, Bug recently joined a choir. This means that he's singing in a musical group. At first, he was feeling really shy because he had not sung in a long time, but he was proud of himself for bravely joining because he really wanted to start singing again. And Hero 
recently had to ask a friend for help with a special construction project on his doghouse. He was hesitant asking for help at first because he's strong and handy, but he was proud of himself for bravely reaching out to ask for help from his friend because it has helped a lot to have another set of eyes and hands on the project. Now, when we are brave or help others be brave, we are certainly being Komochi's kids, which means we are being respectful, responsible, kind, and resilient. Bug, Hero, and I are grateful for the way that you have listened during this lesson. Please take care, be brave, and we will see you next time, Komochi's kids. Thanks for that special report, Mr. Taylor. I'm Tassani, it's time for today's top story. The Ned Show Yo-Yo Sale has been extended to Friday. Miss Age will bring her cart to the neighborhoods for you to make your purchases. Do not send yo-yo orders to the office. In PTO news, start your engines. Wednesday's coin race begins now. Drop your coins, cash, and checks into the collection jar to the library. Congratulations to third grade for being Monday's race winners with 2,660 points. That's $26.60. Now please stand and say the Pledge of Allegiance with me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. That's it for today's news. Catch you next time on Alonzo Down. Thanks for making us a part of your day.